Hey guys, it's another lovely spring day in Montreal. Finally, it's getting warmer and warmer and I'm so freaking happy about this. I mean, winter season is great uh, sometimes. Right, to be honest, uh, only when the snow has fallen and everything is white and nice. But man, freezing days last so long here. Anyways, today I want to talk about those software engineers day and life videos, which you probably all watched and I also shoot them a lot. But the problem with those videos, that's apart from all the fun, you just don't get full sense of what the real day looks like. You don't see all the ceremonies and the routines software engineers have. So I'll try to do my best and explain step by step what we actually do on a daily basis. Those type of videos and real day of engineers have a lot in common, like waking up and turning off your alarm, brushing your teeth, walking a dog if you have one, making a cup of coffee and breakfast, and after all of that, the work kicks in. My teammates and I work from home most of the time. There is one day a week when we go to the office, but that's also not an obligation. So thanks to that, I don't need to waste time commuting, even though I live in 15 minutes walk from the office. So yeah, my day is pretty flexible. Usually I log in around 8 a.m. The first thing I do is check my emails and Slack to see if there are some important messages, announcements or updates in the ongoing threads. Also, if someone left a pull request link, I do a code review right after I'm done with Slack. By the way, a little disclaimer, I can't show the PRs of my colleagues, the company documentation or any other cool things. This stuff is always under NDA. But instead of constantly brewing my screen, I will show a workflow for my open source project playlist mate. I manage it exactly the same way as we do it at work. Alright, so as for the code review, we also check each other requests during the day, just to unblock the teammates from proceeding with their work. And after I'm done with that, I open the Jira board to check my tickets. If you don't know what Jira is, it's a project management tool for tracking everyone's work and making life a bit easier. I might have something unfinished from yesterday and if not, I'll move a new ticket to an investigation or in progress column and start working on that. At 9.30 am we have a daily meeting with our technical director where everyone can ask him anything. A lot of companies and teams have this kind of MAA sessions. You can pitch your idea for a potential feature implementation, ask for help with the blocker or simply have a great talk. I personally learned an enormous useful stuff in there that helped me to polish my technical skills. So definitely don't miss out. And if you're just at the beginning of your journey to becoming a skilled software engineer, as a great starting point, I want to recommend the Software Development Fundamentals course of my partner's course careers. They take you from episode basics all the way to interview prep. The curriculum is perfectly aligned with entry-level jobs and teaches everything required to land a software engineer position. In this course, you will build a solid understanding of computer science and software engineer principles, which can be a game changer in the actual interviews. Also, try yourself in both backend and frontend, choose your path, and go beyond the basics to more specialized topics. So if you guys want to break into tech, there is a free introductory course that you can take with no obligations. And if you use my link, you can get $50 off from the full course. Alright, at 10 a.m. we're having a daily standard meeting. Here we share our updates with the team on what we did yesterday and whether we have any blockers. Just to give you a sense of what it looks like, I'm gonna talk about Playlist Mate as you are my team. Or you know what? You are my team, but on YouTube. So guys, here is my update. Uh, yesterday I made a great progress with fetching tracks from Spotify. I've added a distributed message broker to make sure that the data won't overlap while handling multiple requests at the same time. Uh, currently I'm adding an integration test to cover those changes and then I'm gonna take the next ticket which is PM12, uh, that's for implementation of top playlists. That's my plan for today, I don't have any blockers. So yeah, uh, that's basically it. Okay, stand up is over, what's next? From this moment your day can take different paths depending on your current task. 
It can be an investigation that might take the entire day because you need to propose a solution for a bug fix or a brand new feature or you can code four or five hours straight and that's it. Sometimes you would have demos or technical talks but usually that happens once a week at most. Also depending on your expertise and seniority your agenda can have endless meetings only. But despite the route your day may follow one event is guaranteed for sure. The lunch break. How you spend it is always up to you, but if you ask me, I try to go out for a short walk or a coffee run or do a quick workout, because I am 100% not up to doing it after I log off. I would say I have more energy in the first half of the day, as opposed to the night time. And that's about it. After that, I edit video for you guys, play Xbox and spend time with my love Kaya. Make sure you like and subscribe, especially if you're a developer or want to become one, there will be a lot of content soon. So yeah, see you guys.